The community of Dead by Daylight is a very divided place. We don't often agree on anything. What you think is fun is unfun to other people. What you think is fair is unfair to other people. What you think is balanced is unbalanced to other people, and so on and so forth. But there is one thing, one singular topic that most people find a consensus on, and that is the fact that playing solo queue survivor is terrible. Playing Survivor on your own means that you have to worry about the killer, yes, but also about your teammates. You have no information about what they brought or what their plan is, and any kind of teamwork is very hard to pull off. Sometimes, also, you'll find that your own teammates play in very selfish ways, or even give up immediately, putting you in unwinnable games that are honestly very frustrating. This kind of scenario had happened to me so many times that I was ready to give up and just say out loud that solo queue was unplayable. But at this moment, I talked with a friend streamer of mine and they disagreed with me. They told me that solo queue wasn't that bad and that if I went in with the right attitude and wrote down my statistics, I would find that the average game wasn't all that terrible. I took them up on this offer and decided that for the next few weeks I would play hundreds of solo queue games and write down what I found. And I have to say, the results were surprising. This is a small sample of some of the data that we collected, and at the end of the video, I'm going to give you more data and break it down and explain everything further. But before then, I'm also going to share some of the most insane solo queue matches that we had throughout this whole ordeal. Some of the best, some of the worst, and some of the most fun moments that we had. Get some popcorn, sit back, and enjoy the ride. Oh, uh, hi, Angelito. That's very sweet. Oh, thank you for wishing me a wonderful stream and day. Same to you, buddy. Mother's dwelling, and... Dang, let's go. This map, dude, used to be such a headache for killers. Now, I'm generally not even sure survivors play it well. It is a slinger. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, the, the main thing about this map is that the it still has some windows... I, I've been spotted. Uh, this isn't good. He's not even aiming. Yeah, like, I was gonna dodge, but he wasn't even aiming at us. He's left. Fine. It's still a headache for Dredge? What, this map? I'm, I'm sure it's still bad. I mean, what map isn't good, isn't bad for Dredge sometimes, but... Yeah, all the mid oh, yeah. Uh-oh. He's close, yeah. Say goodbye. Wait, reloading sound. It's gonna hate this. Let's go around this time. I could pre drop this, but. Dude. Dude, does he even have a shot to get me? Ooh, yeah, he does! Oh, nice job! Wow, that's the angle. We learned a thing or two then. Sad part is, he hits me through the thing, right? And it's a long cooldown, and I get a big heads up, a bit head start on the next, uh, on the next run, right? So he has to go through the cooldown. He has to vault. He has to reload. And if the, even after all of those things, he's still 110. So if this map was any bigger, guess what? I would be running and running. And guess what? I brought a medkit, which means that this whole chase. Uh, unless the next one is really quick, it was also a waste of time. Hi, Shinping. Are you the same guy that's been editing my videos without my consent? <laughs> what the hell is wrong with you, man? Oh, okay. I guess I'm better. Small amount of time. Thank you so much for the four years and the... Oh, shit. I'm not gonna lie. I think I was a bit uh, sleepy on that one. Flashlight? No way. Oh my god, you had it! She, she actually got the blind, she just did it too early, I think. He looked he look lost for a second. Ay, 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 what a shame. We have like four gens started. I haven't played DVD in a few years. How's Trapper doing these days? He's gotten a bunch of buffs. Um, but, you know, compared to other killers, he's still kind of on the weak side. Thank you. I mean, I wouldn't even be upset if he sees me and goes for me. Does he do that? Yeah, he does. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is take him away from the gens, because Surge is going to kill us. 
Nice, subtle, but enough. Does he make it around? No, I think so. This is bad for him. What do we have here? Jungle gym? That's it, dude. That's where we're headed. Oh, you're gonna hate this, man. You're gonna hate this. Oh, he's taking it long and wide for some reason. Oh, nasty shot, though. Uh, we have a problem, chat. Uh, our decisive is running out, and we have to mend. He could get me here, technically. Has he reloaded yet? That's why not. If he's looping back, then I'm in trouble. I'm... I'm doing my best to guess, chat. Good job, Belgium. Oh, there's deadlock. That's why they're screwed. I see what's going on. So search deadlock. Ah! All right. Um, believe it or not, Deadheart is not the most reliable against this killer for obvious reasons. So we're gonna have to be real smart. This killer is aware. Watch out, Marigold or whatever the fuck your name is. Crawl as close to the shack as possible. He didn't reload, chat. That's the critical part. He did not reload. Nice. That's good. Crouch so he doesn't know. See him. See him. Okay, chat. Here's what we're gonna do. I, mean, I know he looks through the kills. Nice. There's a pallet there, and we're gonna try to reach it. It'd be super nice if we could get a dram. Bolted immediately. We have a window there. He hasn't. Oh, 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 Shepa! You would have been a god tier teammate if you pulled that off. Uh, sorry, I'll go in the open because she has a flashlight. So, what we tried to do there, chat, is fake an FOB tech. Make it look like I'm super desperate and I don't know what I'm doing. And then he's the moment he realizes, which is like after like half a second, double, 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 double! <laughs> oh, wait, maybe not. Oh, this is a bit concerning that we have no one with Jan. Oh, 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 oh! Uh, that was real nice. Go to the window. Go to the window. Uh, if you do a double blind, you would... Wait, he doesn't know where I am. He got a bit... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's so many people. Maybe he lost track of me. What a team, though! Wow! It's super risky to heal multiple, uh, uh, flash multiple people, because if you do it too quickly, and it kind of stacks, quote-unquote, you will not get it. I need to get some skill check, or else I can't... Oh my god, I'm nervous. Or else I can't fully heal, can I? There you go. Maybe one more? There you go. Woo! Uh, I start this gen now. And if I ever hear as much as a note of the heartbeat, I start to leave. Now, one thing you can do to make the chase a bit harder is drop your item against Linger or Hunters. Sometimes they look at your item when you press space on a window vault or a pallet, and when they know that it disappears, they know that you're doing the animation, so they should then. If you don't have an item, they don't, they don't have that to look at. That's why some survivors drop items. If he sees a gen there being like 90 or half or something, he's gonna be like, okay, survivors were all here. I was by this area that I'm in. Real subtle shot. We still have nowhere to hide. Doesn't seem to. Well, you know what's time to do, chat. Time to get a dren. Do not go through there. Come on, man. Nice, nice, nice! That's perfect! Guess what, Chad? He did not hit me with his power, so I'm not mending, which means this heals me completely. Oh my god, what a team, man. I didn't really know where they are, though, or where the gates were. I didn't even look at it, but this window's pretty nasty. Did we use it? No. No, no, no. Oh, 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 there's the gates! 
Oh, okay, that's it. Is it 99 by any chance? <laughs> yeah, 99% I'm gone. All right. I start walking, maybe he loses me here. No joke. I think he saw me, right? He saw me. No, he didn't. He hasn't. Oh my god. This could be it. This could be... Oh, head on! No way! What a play! Okay, okay, okay. We had a teammate that did something else. I wouldn't mind dying for them, but... I think I did something else elsewhere. Oh, where's the other gate, Chad? I didn't even realize. I don't even know. I'll take this window. Maybe it's the safest place I can be. Oh, dear lord. Oh, dear lord. I'm scared. Hold me, Ash. Hold me. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. fuck. Okay, I think if I take this window now. Oh, he's body blocking, so I... Oh, ah, good effort. Sorry, I thought... Uh, I saw him stop there, so... You don't have a flashlight, do you? No, you don't. Oh, uh, that was still a great effort, though. Wait, you have a toolbox? Does that mean what I think it means? Oh, uh, no. All right, Chad, I I'm sorry. I think the other gate was all the way over there. So, I, I was so panicky. I didn't even know where I lived. <laughs> that was still a good chase, right? What a team, man. What a great team. Not bad. I mean, best case scenario, he chased someone else and then we could have... Because they weren't dead, we could have rescued them, but yeah. Rose had Lucky Star and Head On, which is a really nice combo, by the way. You go into a locker quickly and check on your teams and gens, and Head On always helps. All right, so in the next match, something really interesting happened, and this is going to blow your mind. Somebody used a map offering to go to the RPD, which is an indoor map, and also someone used an offering to spawn the hatch in the shack. And believe it or not, these offerings do work in this map. If you use it on the shack, it will be on the library side. And if you use the offering to spawn the hatch in the main building, it will be on the opposite side, somewhere in the east wing, which is the helicopter side. It sounds a little bit crazy, but it does seem to work. I was telling my chat about it and they didn't believe me. But as you will see, this fact will play a major role in the upcoming match. You are a liar. You doubt me. All right, feel free when it says my butt and we get an extra escape that we wouldn't have had. You will say, thank you, Odds. I will use this in all my games from now on. You are a good friend to me. I will subscribe right now. Yeah, just watch. All right, chase is already started. Those two bosses are together. One of them let go, the other one let go. Do they start chase? They do not. Oh. Oh, I see. What challenge is this? It's not a challenge, Chad, it's science. We're trying to figure things out. Someone else is doing totems as well. Let's call this no pentimento. I mean, we're in a really good place against Myers. This might be one of the best loops ever. Why? Because he can't stalk me over this. Oh, he didn't respect it though. Oh, please tell me you're not tier three. Okay. Oh, this isn't great, but I can keep him here a while, I guess. Is he coming for us after? Nope. I mean, if you're unsure where the killer is, you can sit right here. See? I think I can get away with this. Let's see if my thing plays off. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Oof, sorry, I was trying to press it. Not too early, not too late, you know what I mean? Um, right, I wish I could undo this damage, but hey. All right, I can use life on that window. I don't have life, I need to remember. Oh my God, I keep thinking I have life. I'm stupid, there's a filler pallet. Oh, I don't make it, this guy's bloodless 70 million. Nice, that was good. Ooh, good. Uh, fake it? No. No, don't fake it. I don't know what this man's doing. I'm dropping it. I'm not taking chances. Sorry, bye. Sorry, guys. He has infinite tier 3 with a machine gun up top. Just so you know. Also, Rancor. Uh, don't stop on this pallet because it's death. Go on the next one because it gives us more... Leverage. Oh, we don't make it. Okay. Yeah, stalk me, buddy. What the hell are you doing, bud? What are you doing? He's throwing. He's, he's trying to, like... I don't understand. I'm very confused, guys. Okay. I was headed to that locker. My goodness. Your obsession? Yeah, I get it, but... Like, was he trying to tombstone me? He, If he was stalked, I would have gone thin through him, so he didn't. But there's something, there's something really wrong with this guy, uh, Adam Wise. I don't know what it is, but yeah. This Kinder's gonna be amazing, though. This, this guy should not go down here. 
please don't get tombstone. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, please don't, don't, don't get stuck somewhere, please. It's gonna be so bad. I fed him so much, but I also kept his attention for a while. He's so fast. Oh my God, that's not. Yeah, that I know. I know what it is, Chad. He was he was getting the third stack of bloated food. That's probably what it was. That's why he waited. Oh, I mean, I'm getting tombstone, unfortunately. But this is fine. This is not the worst thing in the world. It could have been tougher. It could have been. It could have been bad. This could be four gens left. There's one gen left, and it's at 50%. Does he lose it? I don't know if he lost it. Uh, by the way, before anyone says I shouldn't have body block, I know, and I didn't try. Just, just so you guys know. But I couldn't stop that. Oh, oh. my god. Uh, he also has permanent uh, tier uh, your food, by the way. Well, Ada has a generator under her trench coat, and she's doing it to 99%. So that's awesome. She out of the blue through two toolboxes, and this is her third one. Yeah, notice that it's not fully repaired. Oh, Ada. Yeah, no, don't give him. It wasn't infinite tier three or anything, but... Oh, you gifted 50? Thanks! Oh my god. Cheers, guys. Wow, please give him a fat thank you if you were one of the gifted ones. And if not, give him a fat thank you as well. Goodness gracious, this guy's fast. Please just sit on the... Just sit on the gen, dude. Just, just don't get caught in the open! Oh, you're so dead. No, that was not the play. Oh, never mind. He doesn't have it quite yet. Oh, man. This girl would be able to help with the last gen if she knew what was going on. Oh. Oh, it's Ada. Oh, it's Primbers out of heaven. Let's go. Oh, no, no, get stay on the pallet. You're gonna get... Uh, you're dead. She's dead. This is the worst thing you can do against the Smyers. Go into a locker to your right if you have it! Dead. Oh, damn, dudes. If you stay on the pallet and you keep vaulting back and forth, like... He can't... Theoretically, he shouldn't be able to kill you, but... All right, good stuff. No, chill. Oh my lord. She's trying to save his life. Oh, this is good. This... They have both have a drain. Something could happen. Nice. Come on, we believe in you. We didn't use any of these pallets. They're all here for you, man. Oh. Actually, we did use one. She's slow vaulting. Oh, risky, but... If it works... You're gonna get a drain anyway, so you might as well use life. Use it now. Use light now. Use light now. Perfect. You get it. You make distance. Maybe go to a gate. He doesn't expect. We had three gens done, by the way. We did. We basically did seven gens, man. <laughs> and now you get a dren. Oh, perfect. Let's go, please. Nice. Oh, that was good. Unfortunately, rancor is a thing. Oh, damn. Right. He doesn't have an infinite tier three. If they want to, they can hide. They can... Oh, never mind. Bill's on. Bill spotted. He's dead. Insta down. Wait. He's not doing it. Balance landing? No, because that ran happen. I'm sorry. You're dead, Bozo. He is killing you. Wait, what? Wait, he wasn't the obsession? Is that right? Chill, run! Chill, no! Oh, okay, he gets Hatch. Hatch is here! Hatch is here! Hatch is right below you! Bill, go, go, go! It's right below you! Run! Run, it's there! It's there somewhere! Run, please! Oh, he, he was closed. Oh, Jill didn't leave! Ah, oh, that's the problem. Jill, what are you doing? Leave, Jill, leave. But yeah, right now I'm gonna tell you, the helicopter side is main. The star's office side, which is this one, is... P Jill, no! Jill, no! Darling! Sweetheart, what are you doing? Leave! Leave! No, dude, he's got it in the back. He's got balance landing. He wants to try, but you can't. Bill, oh no, no, his chances are way less. Because the killer now knows where you are. What are you gonna do? You can't body block for him. Oh my god. No. Okay, Jill, just leave! Please! No. <laughs> Why would you do that? Leave yet hatch right there! Oh my god, man. Please tell. I'm screaming just in case it comes through. Maybe she's my neighbor and she can hear me. 
And he's going to the wrong side that doesn't have the pallet, that doesn't have the sh uh, the hatch. And now he gets moored by Rancor. Well done, Jill. Well done. Awesome, dude. Yeah, go ahead. Go get the hatch. Yeah, go go T-Mac the killer a little bit. You really showed him. <laughs> I can't. I can't watch this. I can't watch this. I'm I'm so sorry, but like, how can you be so dense? What a shame, dude. That's one of the most heartbreaking games I've ever played in my life. Some people play in a game in a way that you might find really obnoxious, but to them, they're just playing the game, and it was a good game to them. You know, they'll just they'll just say GGs at the end. And that's fine, I guess. Just accept it, I suppose. You can let them know, hey, I don't appreciate that, you know? And who knows, maybe they'll take it to heart, but... Uh, I just don't want to be on that one shot. I feel like... Oh, it's a demo. Alright, I'm dying. Ay, ay, ay. Let's do this one. So probably no pain dress. Yeah, it's probably a devour hope or something. It's good to know, though. We're gonna start searching for it. Maybe after one gen. Uh-huh. Sure. Nice. Oh, this pilot's gone, though. Alright, that's good. They got her. Wait, what's he doing? He's... Does he want a tunnel, or...? I think we convinced him to let go. That was good. I don't have anything too strong here. Oh, never mind. He allows me. So unfortunate. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I don't make the rules. We go through this little room and then back into that strong pallet, maybe? Oh shit, do I rage it? Fucking hope so. So what did the first time work and the second one didn't? Because the second one he was centered on me. That's the that's the key with uh, holding control and crouching. I'm gonna lie, I'm a bit worried. Okay, so what happened in the next few seconds is actually quite critical. The Kate came to rescue me, but instead of healing me together with Nia, she went and tried to destroy the Demogorgon portal. This was quite unfortunate, because if they heal me together, we probably could have finished in time before the killer came back, but instead, this happened. Uh -huh. Alright, please don't see me, buddy. Oh, wow, he checked every corner before finding the right spot. This room's bad for me, though. <laughs> no fucking way! That just fucking worked! How did we not get a heal with two people in? I'm, 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 was I not paying attention? If you guys are gonna heal me, like, please use the mech kit or something. Please just do it fast. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's not even sloppy or anything. This could be Devour, dude. Oh my god, this is terrifying. Could be Devour. Hope you use him too. Oh, really? No, it would be revealed. No, guys, you're wrong. No, M2, M2 reveals Devour Hope. On this, on every killer, except Lake, but I'm sure she, they fixed that. So, no, I think you're wrong. Good, good theory though. Could be. Oh, hold up, we won't actually play it really safe here. Oh. He has barbecue or has the brain the size of a melon, dude. Alright, please let me tell me this pod's still up. Oh well, good. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, guys. My, uh, actually, we might have got good pilot here. I do not care, dude. I am dropping that. Oh, he fucked it up. Kate, hold me. Help. Take five or six or hits for me, will ya? Oh, that was good. Uh, not too good though. Not too good. Uh, fuck, the strongest pilot in this area has been used already. The fuck do I do, chat? Keep running, maybe he overthinks it. Yeah, let's see if we have the one in library. That could actually be pretty good. This one's not too bad either, so let's go back here if we need to. Ooh. Ruin's still up. That was probably undying. 
Yeah, that part is good. Oh shit, he sent me. Hey! What's up, dude? We have a bit of distance, so I'm gonna go all the way around. Please tell me he's not coming this way. I don't see him, chat. I have no clue what's going on. Oops. Oh yeah, he's on to us. Alright, chat. I'm not sure I'm this. Oh, I actually make it? I don't even need to use the pallet yet. Yeah. Man, he knows about this, though. Uh, we had a pallet that was real strong all the way up here. If we can make it that far. Uh, I'm sorry, team! Oh, thanks, team! Bye! Well, alright. If we get a gem done, that's lovely. Oh, man. I was playing like a demon? Thanks, yeah. Feels good though, because I... Like, I, I feel like I'm more controlled than before, you know what I mean? Compared to my old PC, I probably would have been hit 65 times in this series alone. Alright, well, back to this, I guess. You're a juicer? Thank you, I feel much better about my gameplay, thanks. I still can improve though. It won't go down, right? I have no fucking clue what we have here, Chad. I don't think there's anything good here. So, yeah. Please do fucking jets. I don't know what my friends have been doing this whole time. But, hey. I'm not gonna drop this pallet. I'm gonna take this window. Uh, that was a risky approach, but, I mean, we have to take risks or else we're dead. Is he following? Nope. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Other way, other way, other way. Uh, I think I make that, though. Spam spacebar. Go all the way around and we take the window again. This window's always here, by the way. It's not RNG. So you don't need windows opportunity to see it coming. Ah, uh, I got stuck. We drop this pallet. No, we fake like we drop this pallet. And then... We don't use the window this time, but we use this. Ah, oh, that was my mistake. I'm like, I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait. But, yeah. That being said, though, last gen's done. Imagine if I lasted five more seconds. Nice. Drop me, drop me, drop me. Drop me, check, check around. See? There's, there's room for improvement. If we somehow manage to stun the killer and make distance, we get a dread. And instead of giving him maybe two kills, which might happen now, we give him maybe one or zero. This is so well? Yeah, that was good. This doesn't look like three people out to me, though. And I'll also, I've used a lot of resources, so... Good luck. Ah, uh, yeah, I see the problem. Well, chat! <laughs> Could it be Undying? I know it. Nah, it was Undying, Ruin, something else, uh, no way out. A barbecue. Or That's so sad. I mean, well earned by the killer, though. No problem there. Yeah, it's probably barbecue, because look at her perks. She's lost stacks. Interesting idea? Can they get this girl? How far is she? I don't know about this. I don't think Nia's inclined. Okay, what Nia's doing is basically wasting time. They can make it. They can make it. Haha. <laughs> Don't steal the killer's wallet. This is good, by the way. Doing this kind of stuff is good. Because the killer is probably not trying their best. But if you give them two kills, they'll take it. So, yeah, that's nice. They have an interesting strategy. They're just... This kill doesn't even look behind her. This is a good a good place. Stop and heal here. Kate, no. Kate, listen to your friend. He's probably screaming behind you like, Don't do it! The killer's right there! Kate, don't do it! Oh, never mind. Dude, you are not serious. Don't tell Should they actually get away with this? Wait, what? Did the killer teleport in front of her? 
Oh my god, I thought he teleported in front of her. <laughs> that would have been so funny. Uh, I think he might have the E with the Sonata on and he's trying to find them with the auto. Do Kate, if I see you team at this killer for even a second, I swear I will report you. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. No. No. <laughs> She's had a hook as well! No! Kate, why would you do that? He's not saving you. He could take one hit, but there's no way. <laughs> so deserved! Oh my god. See? You guys didn't believe in my teammates, but they eventually delivered a good YouTube clip. <laughs> It was barbecue chat. That's why we. That's why we were found. Uh, you remember that time? <laughs> you remember that time? That was unexpected. <laughs> Cheers. All right. Well, this is the first match after four games where the killer didn't use a map offering. So that's kind of sweet. Thanks. This. I don't know if this gen is a good idea to. Oh, it's probably a blight then. Yeah, this gen is super open, and when the killer... This is companies during Pride Month. Companies after Pride Month. Companies during Pride Month. After. During. After. During. After. During. After. Uh, yeah. Normally, when I'm a killer in this map, but I don't find anyone, I go up top, and then I look this way. There's the blood we called. Uh, she's dead. Wait, wait, wait. Can you go under the pallet? Oh, you dropped it. Okay. Sure. I would use the medkit, but I think we can afford this. Oh, Cordophobia is going for the multi slug. Alright, so for those of you that have never seen one, there are some players out there that pick strong killers like Nurse or Blight, and they never bother to hook anyone. They bring perks to make the slugging and the picking up much, much harder on the survivor side, and they are beatable, but your team needs to be quite coordinated, and if you're going down quickly, it is almost impossible to bring the game back. Just from a quick glance at this match, it's very clear that this Blight was exactly that type of player. Okay, we need to be really careful. Shit. Well, I mean, let that gen go, I guess. We have one in shack. Let's do the stripper save. Should you generally do save or risky gens at the beginning of the match? That's such a difficult question, Chad. It, it depends on the killer. It depends mostly on what your teammates are doing. Like, for example, if you go... Let's say that there's corrupt intervention, right? And you go in the basement, you're like, I'm gonna wait here two minutes. That can be the best idea ever if your teammates all decide to also hide and they're all successful. But it's the worst idea ever if your team gets found immediately because you're not doing gems, right? So it depends. I would say, generally speaking, as you can see with this game, you can assume your teammates to be incompetent and just get chased immediately and go down in three seconds. Which, let's be honest, you can't blame them for too much. Uh, yeah, all right, we'll, we'll go get high charges. Um, I can't pick them up because of Cordophobia, and if I do, you know, it's got Alkring or whatever, it's over. They get down, and now I'm... Um, so if you guys could KYS yourselves on the hook, that would be awesome. Thank you. We still have Ultimate Weapon for the love of Christ. Yeah, what, what was the other game that we didn't... Uh, that I forgot? Maybe in that game I had a bit more agency. Alright, so we're gonna check this as a spot, and then... We're bad, actually. I'm lucky, buddy. Oh, really? GG's. Sorry, fellas. Look, look, it's it's exactly what we called. Leon, you antimate. Do you genuinely think I could have helped more? Like I tried to pick up that girl, and then the blight came back. And now with Chlorophobia, that heal was going to take 10 seconds. And it takes him one second to come there. And after he hits me, it takes him one second to hit me again. And after that, there's one survivor left. Yeah, they just they just said that I'm, I'm a bad teammate. <laughs> just, I'm sorry, man. Like, like you got to realize 
I did nothing, but I also could do nothing. I, other than go and die, I can go and die, and maybe the killer decides to leave us on the ground for four minutes. Nothing stopping them, by the way, from doing that. Why, man? Why? Uh, will you be at TwitchCon? Hi, Dio. Thank you so much for asking. Uh, the tickets to TwitchCon Amsterdam, no, uh, Rotterdam, uh, are out now. And yes, me and Nina will attend. I would be super, super happy to meet you there, Chad. So, yeah, I'd love to see you at TwitchCon Rotterdam, I think. Is my Chad the most progress? No. Will you stream at TwitchCon? No, no, I'll just be enjoying the moment. I'll take a couple days off while I do that. Damn, dude, Billy's just tough. Um, that girl's being chased. We have Ruin, which is quite unfortunate in this situation. Um, I really cannot tell if Jill is going to take the unhook. I'm going to walk in between them. If she gets the unhook on left, I go unhook on right. I see the problem. I'm guessing she's too busy. I'm also guessing... Oh, nice. Very good. Okay, that was so good that we came here. Um, yeah, that girl probably busted her toolbox to get that much progress. Sorry, hasn't crossed to him. Okay, um, stand still. Stand still. No? Okay. Alright, whatever. Uh, good run, Jill. Well done. Oh, no. I could have used... You know what I should have done, chat? Since the killer wasn't around, I should have used uh, reassurance to show both of these people that I have the perk. Could be useful later. Yeah. Question. Do I get to finish this gen? I think so. Maybe. What's the timer on the gen? Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, what is Tab doing? Is he going for the rescue? Do I need to let go? I have reassurance if I show up there last- Oh, dude. Oh, man, we have a problem. We have a problem, chat. That guy's not gonna get her, is he? Let's wait three seconds. If I don't see the pickup, I go. He's on me. I think I heard him. Yeah, he's here. He's absolutely- I don't know why in the hell he's in that side of the map, but hey, whatever. I'm gonna reassure and then go for the other rescue, maybe. Hold up. Uh, it's gonna look a bit weird, but I think it's gonna make sense. Okay, we reassure through the floor. I'm a bit, of, I'm a bit afraid that the killer could be, like, fate, like you know, um, proxy camping. So I think this is pretty smart. We have a window there. Do I take it? No. If I take it, I think I'm dead. Uh, f uh help. Okay, it's not low pro, which is good. That's. I don't know, Chad. Do I get that? I'm dying probably. Unless I run into her. Nice. Ah, very good. Uh, that's a bit crazy, right? Yeah, he's bumping. Uh, I might generally run. Mm, no, I can't. It's quite ambitious. Uh, no pallet, but I do have a pallet there. Oh, he's getting me here. Oh. Nice, we got stunned. I probably can make it, though. I run this way. We die on this. Uh, do we have basement here? We do not. I don't know if that was bamboozle. It was. Nice, he messed it up though. Okay, good. Uh, that was a giga play. Yeah, I mean this map is not the first one that you think about when you're when you think about multiple floors, but it counts, right? To be fair, it was like a one-inch thing. Though. Like, <laughs> if that house was any small, oh, any smaller, that would have been bad. I used the bamboozle because I always forget about it. Oh no, if you're Billy, you don't forget about it. Hi, Melancock. Thank you so much for the tier three. That's so kind. I, I understand what you mean, but I don't think that's the case for... I'm in trouble here, guys. I don't think that's the case for um, M1, maybe. Yeah, you could hear the swing. Um, with, with Billy, survivors will very naturally gravitate towards windows. So it's super normal that you use it during your normal chase. <laughs> it's bumping quite a lot. I don't know why my team has so much trouble dealing with him. I guess maybe he got a bit lucky. Okay. Yeah, he's 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 not afraid to just try his best and bump into everything. I could heal now. All right, time, time to heal maybe. <sighs> this is looking so bad, man. We have two survivors that if they go down, the game's over. 
At three gems, the game's over. And normally, in this situation, I wouldn't even heal, man. I had to let go of my gen in the main building. Did it get done? I don't know. Did it get done, Chad? Yikes, I don't know. Did anyone do it? We've done two gens. It must have, right? It must have. I mean, the people that are on the hook see their teammates. Like, when you're dying on the hook, you see your teammates. So they know that I'm coming from that gen. 100%. They should have. Are you getting solo queued? I mean, I don't know. Like, sometimes... Like, like, could you argue that the problems of this match are solo queue? Maybe, but... At the end of the day, even if you... Like, imagine that these guys were all my friends, right? If they're going down in... In just a few seconds... And taking the killer towards the hook... You know, these are things that... Solo queue or not, you're gonna lose. Alright, Chad. Uh, we don't want him to use Bamboozle. I'm gonna try something a bit wild. I'm gonna go all the way around. And then back into one of the windows. I'm fine. There's always three open windows in this map. That's how it works. Okay. He's gonna break this. Wait, no. Uh, you know what? Because he hasn't broken it, I'm... He's left, actually. Let him see me? Maybe he chases me? Nah, he doesn't care about us. The Adam was going into main building earlier because he wanted to do his archive. Yeah, that might be what he was doing. But it's crazy, man. Like, like teammate on the hook, teammate on the hook. You know, like, and you're just doing your archives. Like, come on, man. You can't do that. You can't. You can't. So sad, man. So sad. <sighs> New Billy is stronger than Spirit. Some people believe that, and who knows? Maybe they're right. I... I don't feel super confident saying that. Do you think I stay here? Nah. Nah, I mean, I could further people buckle up, but... Alright, chat. No, no offense, but why is the Adam doing totems? Why, man? Like, why? Like, I get the game is looking a bit bad, but this is the kind of game that you can genuinely come back if you try a little bit, man. A little bit. <laughs> Alright, so what do we have? This pilot's gone. I don't make that, do I? Let's try. This pilot's gonna be gone as well. Screw me. We have a pilot down here. Let's see if it's still up. It's not. I'm dead. So my teammates somehow have barely done any gens. They've done one gen among all of them. They did not last particularly long in chase. And they've also managed to use half the resources in the map. How is Shag Pilot gone, this pilot gone? How is this even possible? Oh, dude. It's so sad, man. Well, good luck, uh, Adam, getting the hatch. Man. A bit tough. Right, sorry, died as quickly as I could. Oh no. The killer found the hatch. That's so unfortunate. Okay. If Adam could listen to us, yeah, he could He could do the thing where he taps the gate to like 24% so it doesn't have a red light on it. He also has the archive thing, so it doesn't, he didn't run or drop or anything. He's been holding to it the whole time. Okay, do the, do the thing, do the thing, tap it, tap it, dude, tap it, tap it. Don't open fully, Do uh, you need to stop at the A. So when you hit the C, you stop there. That's good enough. Very nice. Uh, it might still not be good, but he needs to be really brave about this. Yeah, go, go, go. Now. No, 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 no. So no, 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 run. Don't crouch, roll. Don't walk. You need every millisecond. <gasps> he, he, the killer's taking like 10 seconds to go back and forth, and you need like 15. I mean, he wouldn't have made it anyway, Chad, but... We really don't know if these people are just... Relative beginners, or if there, if this was just mixed communication on everyone's part, it's quite unfortunate. Um, honestly, no problem to me if we just want to play this in the most boring way imaginable. Oh, uh, is this West Wing? No, it's East Wing. Yeah, yeah, chase me, chase me. Oh yes, oh, oh, so good. Chase me, chase me. I'm definitely running to all of my teammates 
It's gonna be so good for you. Oh, you're gonna get all the downs and all the lefts and all the stuffs. Oh, and I have smash. That's so unfortunate. Does she continue the chase? Let her see me. Okay, good. We don't have a pallet here. It means it's in this room. Do we use it? Uh, no. We keep running. We use this one, then we go back to that one. Uh, she's gonna crouch, probably. Bye-bye. That's the pig's power, by the way. You crouch and people leave you alone. Nah, you think I wouldn't do this, but I will. As, as long as my teammates all get their trap, eventually you'll run out of steam. This this build is all about the early game. Let's make the early game terrible. This is East Wing now, so... The, unfortunately, I... I I'm not gonna do it. Okay. Alright, surely if there were any traps here, they've been out of the search, right? Alright, she hears, she hears a gen up top. Why aren't you guys removing any of the traps, man? Oh, I don't like this anymore. I'm thinking we wasted time for nothing. Okay. If we drop this pallet, it's over for us. Is there a pallet on that side? There is. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, she breaks it. Okay, never mind. That's good then. I'm gonna go back here, because honestly, there's no one. We're gonna go... No! Don't drop, lady! You were doing fine! I guess she 99 it. Uh, that was my bad. Sorry. Oh my god. Are you serious now? She's just gonna run by and interrupt you. Oh, never mind. There's a hook here. Not even. Oh. I'm... It's kind of... Like, they have the right idea, 99 gents. But get the searches done, man. When you get the searches done, then you have one guy that doesn't have the worries. He can go and unhook, you know, and do all the stuff. Okay. Not sure where Killer is. Oh, uh, thank you, Alan. Okay, I'm gonna do something a bit stupid. If she leaves me alone? I might do this search now. Alright. Because let's be honest, this map is pretty bad. Wait. Wait, you can lose stacks on Jigsaw searches? Alright. This is gonna go super well, guys. So this killer has the add-on to start with the traps, but she also has rule set number two, which removes all the trap, uh, all the trap auras until the trap is active. So it actually would have been kind of a good thing to maybe pop one of the gents now. Like clearly she's not gonna kill all of us at once. Oh, I'm sorry, that pallet's missing, dude. Please no, please it's sloppy butcher as well. Oh, uh, she's gonna go for me, of course. I would. Oh, okay. This is bad. Um, I don't have a good pallet. Can you take a hit for me? Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, perfect. That's all, that's all, man. That's all I need. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will not waste this opportunity, I promise. Okay. I, I need to get going, though. None of these people are close to dying immediately, but I can. He removed his. Yes, that's lovely. There might be one outside here. I think it's time to pop this. And now the traps are visible. If I get spotted here, I'm dead AF, though. I hate that I'm wasting tokens on this, by the way. But whatever. Yeah. Alright, so how do I make this count, chat? How do I make this chase count? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, they need to protect me, I think. I'm not sure I make that pallet. Maybe I do. Maybe I do. I'm definitely gonna interrupt that person healing with... Whatever the heck, so sorry about that. Okay, I'm gonna try to not go there right away. Okay, that's good. Um. Oh, that's kinda nice. That's kinda nice. Oh, thank you. Um. Now we got some stuff up here, I guess. I'm guessing... Please tell me she's not coming up. This is a bit scary against Brick, though. Okay. Um. Yeah, she's there. Um. Is she onto me still? Question mark. No, she's on Alan. Good. Let's go search. Uh, we don't two. We might need to do four. Do we, we have time? It's just, like, not if I run into the killer. Uh, slow ball. We actually want to stay stealthy if possible. Oh, please don't fucking hear me. How far is she? 
Okay, nice. Bruh. I hit my life. I'd get a heal, but I mean, it's not gonna matter if I die. Okay. Please hit the normal. Oh, I can't hit normal skill checks, I guess. Uh, by the way, before anyone asks about this build, I have no idea what this build is. I don't remember equipping it. That's kind of nice, though. All right. Would be super sweet if we could get a heal now, but now we're at the point where I can't just care about myself anymore. I need to care about the team. Could do the Shen. It's pretty safe. It's got at least one pallet. If I get, if I see the killer, I'm probably dead. But I could always run back, and there's one right directly below me. Bond being super useful here. If she stops the chase, but we still hear the terror. Oh shit, 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 shit! Am I late? Am I late? Am I late? I am late as fuck. There was a pallet right there, man. Man, this blows. I don't want to leave the gen. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's my mistake, though. Oh, man. Oh, well. Could have done a bit better, to be fair. She has a brown med kit. Oh. I mean, off the record's kind of good, though. You're not gonna get spotted, at least. That's good. That's really good. Nice. Honestly, this team can make it. This is... Yeah, there's windows, there's one pallet, and I think it's the unsafe one. So this guy is better off just running top or... Yeah, keep running, I guess. What does he use here? Nothing. I mean, if he reaches that pallet, that's good. Last two gens about to pop. He Does he have a gen? No, he doesn't. Oh, 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 that's good, that's good. Keep running, keep running. Don't stay on this loop. Yeah, 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 perfect. Oh, a gen would have been incredible there. All right, let's see if there's no way out. There's no, no way out. And both kits are being open. I like this, dude. Well done, man. Oh, dude. There's so many times when you just die and it's like, oh, okay. I guess there was nothing holding this team together, you know? But this wasn't the case. These guys did their job. Even if it took a little while. Oh, 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 um, she takes window and Nancy takes a hit, probably. Oh, nice! Nancy goes for the rescue! Dude, this can work. This kills that on hook, though. She doesn't have any exhaustion perk. Oof. Okay, Alan needs to just open a gate. That's, um... She picked up my key. By the way, my key uh, I was using for some challenge. It was supposed to have a Blood Amber, but I think I ran out, so... Okay. Well, two kills is a decent result, right? Watch out for Blower then, I guess. Wait! Keep hitting your skill checks, lady! Nice. Okay. Right. Alright. Uh, I don't know what perks they had. I didn't notice much other than Sloppy Butcher. Wow, just a tunneler. <laughs> oh my god, the cheekiness. Yeah, this guy's did well. Oh my god, they use an RPD offering. That sucks. Why would they use bamboozle though? On oh, RPD? Sure, there's like a window or two that are mean, but literally one or two. Yeah. Brutal, almost unnoticeable. Rapid. I don't think it was a huge deal either. Yeah, strange build, but this alone was already strong. Jesus. I'll play a team. Oh man. Yeah, if we had some better perks, maybe. I, I find it infuriating that stakeout works against the big boxes. Like, I don't know why I have this on right now, but I would have liked to save it for the gens. <laughs> Alright, this is a difficult map to have no info perks on. You know what? I always feel like the killers. Don't check the middle. Normal Harvey? Oh dear. Oh, it's a plague! Oh, that's cool. No problem with that. She kicked the gen nowhere to hide, potentially, and puked on it, which is cool. If I had bald, uh, bond, by the way, it would be amazing being w able to... Chat and w oh, hi, Hermosita. What's up? Do you guys know that in Spanish, we don't say the H out loud? It's just like it's not there. It's silent. 
But yeah, like if I had Bond, I would try not to run into my teammates, but I don't know if we have that luxury right now. Let's check this place for a gen. Oh. Killer's there. Alright, question chat. Do I find a gen that's unspoiled or do I just touch this and bite the bullet? I'm biting the bullet. Hey, Dwight, what's up, buddy? Not feeling too good? I think you're headed to the killer, but... Oh, no, I guess not. Uh, Chad, this isn't looking too good for me, is it? Oh, I do make it, I do make it, I think. Bye, yep. Okay, I tried to, like, fake it. I'm sorry, uh, boys and girls. Uh, <laughs> What's my safety, Chad, once I reach it? Once I reach this place? I mean, I keep just bringing her next to... That's a fix done, I think. I'm so sorry, I, I'm just giving her a tour of all the gems we're doing. Yeah, whoever's here, get out, lady. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, never mind. Yeah, 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 come, come, come. She's coming. She's coming, yeah, that's good. I take over that gen if she doesn't chase us. And don't use the infirmary. Oh. All right, Gabriel is doing an amazing job, by the way. Gabriel's job right now is not to be infected. Yeah, okay, good. So that we don't have the like Thana is two four six percent, but then on the fourth it jumps to twenty percent, which is brutal as fuck. You don't want to get twenty percent, ideally. Okay, she's going back to all the gems that she has seen probably. I could reassure or rescue. I just don't want her to get tunnel. In this map, by the way, this is one of the best maps for reassurance. You can actually reassure through floors. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep running, keep running. Keep running. Uh, she's dead, chat. Um, uh, you use the pallet. Use the pallet if you can. That's nice. I think I make it to this one. I'm so sorry. Uh, what's your fucking name? Save my life! And guess what? I can last a little bit longer now. Oh! 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 Jesus Christ! Where are you? You demon! Okay. Well, <laughs> that was pure miracle. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna do one loop and then go into the thing, I think. You know what? Sure, dude, I'll take it. That was decent. Yeah. Pandas? It's happening. Damn, all of them really close. Thank you. Yeah, this kind of blows, man, not gonna lie. Do you think Pandas is the killer equivalent to all that hard? No? Like, in the sense that it's a strong perk that everybody uses? Yes, but... There has to be a better way to compare it. Adrenaline and Painters are have more in common than uh, than Painters. Holy <laughs> fucking Christ Almighty! Right. Did she open that? Please tell me she didn't. Fucking kill me, dudes. She's dying in basement, then, isn't she? No, she got rescued. Holy fuck. She got quote unquote tunneled off hook. Someone went into a locker, maybe. The the, the sun is just brutal, man. Should I cleanse chat? I'm going to. Wait, but if I cleanse, I can't do that gem anymore. This blows, man. It should be Dwight cleansing and then going for the rescue. This is. Like, yeah, okay, Thana no longer at 20%, but guess what? Guess what? No one's doing gens anyone, anyways. It doesn't matter. Fucking kill me. She's going back to the uh, hook. Okay. That girl is cleansing, so I don't mind getting injured. You need to go, dude. You need to go cleanse and rescue if possible. I know it's... Like, he doesn't know it. Because he hasn't been hooked by this plaything. So I feel like I'm in a really bad spot to go. Like, how, how, dude? How do I do this? Even if I had Kindred, like, I would not be able to go. He started a new gen. This is bad. We don't know if she's proxying, but... Yeah. Oh, man. 
He lets go. This guy's gonna hit stage two. Nothing we can do about it. Alright, please do I tell me you're going for that rescue, man. Come on. Tell me you're going for that rescue, Dwight. You're not going for that rescue? Is anyone going for that rescue? Is the killer right fucking here? Fuck, yeah, she's camping. What do you think, Chad? Is it, is it worth it to go for him? I can try. I can try. Dude, do I even make it? I need 8 seconds and he has like 20. Fuck, dude. I don't know if I make it, dudes. They're both being chased. I'm gonna try, dude. I'm gonna try. I promise you, if you die, it will be despite my best efforts. Do not miss the final skill check. I need you not to miss the final skill check. Do not miss the final skill check. Do not miss the final skill check. I got you, dude. Oh, he might have died if it wasn't for reassurance. I remember that last second. I love you, Gabriel. Don't die on me, man. Oh, shit. Go, 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 go. She didn't see that coming. I mean, whatever, man. If he has a size of that, would be, dude, I would kiss him in the mouth. Yes! Come to this pilot, buddy, Voltet! I'll leave. Come to the pilot. You remember I dropped the it right? It's here. You don't have a lot there. I'll leave as soon as I see you come. Wait. That sounds like some of my one night stands. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, I pro. <laughs> okay. Okay, he's over there. Damn. She's, she's on her stairs. She used that heart. Let's go, dude. My teammates are on a chat as well. I love you guys. You're the best teammates I've ever had. <laughs> Come on, dude. Oh, no. oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Sorry, I'm screaming so I didn't hear the skill check. Oh, man. Thana, 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 Thana is just destroying us. All right, one bit of silver lining. If he dies right now, Thana doesn't work. No pain. Please, no painters. Oh, my God. He didn't give painters. Oh, he's dropping! Wait, why? Maybe maybe she got a bit greedy and realized she couldn't make it? Let's go! Wow! Okay, now the job, the assignment, is to either over cleanse. Uh, this is my thing. I could do it, honestly. Do I do it? I do it, maybe. But I, I can't body block. Like, it's not like I can show up there and body block or anything. Because she got power. Her power goes to survivors. So I do this for my own awareness. I cleanse up top so that she can do it. Gabriel might die, but trust me, he's going to be more useful in death than 900 billion of my other solo queue teammates in life. Uh, luckily, Thana doesn't uh, slow down the exit gate, so now we play the long game, okay? And ideally, we get our s oh, we get our dead heart back. Um, as you can see, my dead heart is like uh, 10 seconds away. And now it's the really useful moment to have my heart beat. Everyone chill until that timer runs out or she picks up another. No one's in chase. Oh, someone's in chairs. Okay, we go. If I hear them coming this way, maybe I hide, make it look like this gate's not being open. But keep in mind, I cannot body block for this girl or anything like that. Yeah, do I understand the assignment? I could use that hard, though. That could be good. I could use that hard. Let's go, dudes. Clearly, the Dwight's closer to me than he is to the other one. Wait, she took a hit? Can I help you guys? Yes? I got you! What's this? Just in case? I'm fine. I'm completely fine. How about you guys? Oh, they're going up! Maybe they drop through the hole! Clicks, clicks, clicks! Yes! Go, go, go! I got you! Yes! She ran out of power. Let's go! Nice three man out, right? Well, that guy cleansed and she ran out of power. If he sprints properly, that's it. Oh, I don't get the spec that he made it out! Let's go! GG's, you guys are unbelievable. Medal of honor to each of you. Now, let me tell you, chat, what we just dodged, okay? So this killer never infected directly because she had the funny meme medal, which is really strong. But the fact that all of us knew instinctually not to cleanse the playthings because there could be pentimental, that was huge. That was so huge. If we had done totems and then she lights up the totems with panty and then she pukes on them which lasts even longer right like it's 35 de no 40 seconds they buffed it 40 plus 40 plus 30 so that's like more than two minutes that dude like pentimental would have destroyed us oh my god dude dude oh my god dwight understood that the gabriel had gone down in basement which is 
almost never painless and hit stage two on basement and for his final hook the killer was going to take gabriel to pain rest, which would have destroyed our gen and we would have lost the game. But Dwight with Saboteur saw the yellow aura of the hook. He immediately put two and two together. Notice that the killer would go inevitably like mods to a flame to that hook. He waited by that hook. He Saboteur that hook. Then the guy had to be dropped. Then he got adrenaline. And oh my god, this is the best game I ever played in my life, dude. What, dude? All right, I hope that you enjoyed that gameplay. Now it's time to look at the data that we gather from these 262 games. Some of them I played off stream. Most of them I played live on stream. If you want to catch our streams, there's a link down below if you want to drop us a follow. Now, the most popular killer by far was Hailbilly. He has been reworked recently and he's very powerful and he's pretty fun, so no surprise there. Wesker has been incredibly popular since his release, so also no surprise to see him tied with Blight, who is overall the most popular killer in the game for the last few years at higher MMR. So yeah, most popular killers were completely expected. The least popular killers were also what you would expect. Now, in terms of kill rate, an anonymous viewer of mine was very kind to do a statistical analysis and give us a full breakdown of each killer's kill rate. Now, out of the killers that we had several matches on that were most reliable in terms of data, the highest kill rate went to Billy. Again, not surprising, he's very strong right now. And Nurse and Blight. Nurse and Blight are the top strongest killers in the game, so also makes quite a bit of sense, right? Now, Twins was the last killer to be ever seen. Uh, also, the person that we played against playing Twins was a stream sniper, so if it wasn't for them, the Twins might have never been seen in hundreds of games. This is a bit depressing, but it's also very predictable. In almost any statistics that we look at, the Twins is the least played killer by a long shot, so yeah, nothing, nothing crazy there. Now, this is some of the most interesting part. On average, killers had a 2.2 kill rate on, on average. This is exactly what the developers want, by the way. The developers want the killers to kill a little bit more than 50% for several reasons. And even though I think I am a decent survivor, I am a decent player, and I have a lot of hours, despite my best efforts, I never managed to get the win rate above 40%. Maybe slightly above 40, but it never went any higher than that. Most of the games resulted in all survivors dying, so that dispels some myth. Some people think that because the hatch exists, survivors always get one escape. That's not true. Whenever I went into a match, I knew that the most common outcome, the most common result would be four kills. And this is a little bit depressing. Even though when I play killer, I can win 70% of my games or more easily, even with handicaps, even with challenges, when I try my best at Survivor, despite my best efforts, I can get my teammates to win, that is, get three or four escapes more than 40% of the time. So what happens in solo queue is that the MMR is so effective at finding a balance of teammates and killer that you're going to be at a 50% win rate pretty much all the time. Pretty much all the time. Uh, it doesn't matter if you're very good. doesn't matter if you're very bad. You're essentially going to be normalized uh, thanks to the matchmaking doing its job. It is a bit depressing, though, knowing that you cannot carry your team. Uh, that being said, keep in mind, for this experiment, uh, there were a lot of things I didn't do. I didn't bring any of the strongest items. I never brought map offerings. I limited myself in some of the things I could bring. So that does mean that, you know, potentially you could do a little bit better. Now, one of the more depressing facts about the whole data is the disconnection or give up rate. We wrote down every time a teammate would disconnect early or give up early, and this happened 14% of the matches. I'm not going to lie, in my mind, I thought this number would be as high as 20, 25, or 30%. Uh, subjectively, it felt like every other game we had someone give up. But it turns out that in the grand scheme of things, this doesn't happen as often as I thought. Now, if we look at it objectively, this means that in out of every seven games, you're going to have one match that is just straight up unwinnable. Your teammates just give up. There's nothing you can do to win pretty much after that. That's still appalling. That's still awful. Especially if you compare it to the rate at which killers disconnected. Every now and then, a killer would be very upset and they would just DC rage quit. But this only happened about 3% of the time. 3% versus almost 15%. Yeah, that's not very good. Another thing that I found really horrible is the fact that map offerings are so unbelievably common. At one point, map offerings were using like one third of the matches. Eventually, this went down a little bit to 26%. I still think that that's terrible. We all know that some maps are very unbalanced to either side. And the fact that one out of every four matches 
is one side trying to send themselves to their most favorable map, I find this terrible, and yeah, it really is a problem. Not something to do with solo queue, but a problem nevertheless. And then we get to the saddest number out of everything we collected, which is the 46% figure. Every match, I try to figure out whether or not something had happened that would have been easily prevented with teamwork. So, for example, um, if I know of a perk and I try to warn my teammates, but my teammates don't understand and then they die to that perk, that is a solo issue. In fact, I'm going to give you a very clear example of what a solo queue issue is. This is a clip from a friend of mine. In this clip, my friend is using the perk um, plot twist to down themselves and heal themselves on the ground and they are completely fine. But then their teammate is completely clueless and they come in trying to heal them, which they don't have to because... They don't, they don't need to, they're going to heal themselves on the ground. And then the killer shows up, chasing the other guy, and then everything goes south. This is the kind of situation that would never happen if you had the most basic amount of communication or the most basic amount of pre-existing teamwork. This is what we call a solo issue. In almost half my matches, I identified one or more times when we had something really bad happen because we couldn't communicate something simple like that. And yeah, it's not very nice. Uh, one thing that was a little bit nicer and honestly quite uh, quite positive is the fact that toxic behavior was pretty rare. If you count teabagging and, and some slight bad manners as toxicity, then that happened about 16% of the time. And if you only count toxic behavior, like the really nasty stuff, like saying uh, insults and stuff like that in the post game, that only happened about 6% of the time. So... I would say that that's one of the more positive things. If you don't start out beef with people, for the most part, the games were pretty chill. Uh, people were very polite or they didn't say anything at all. Uh, cheaters are an unfortunate part of the game as well, but at least obvious cheaters, we only noticed two of them, I think, over the course of the entire experiment. Uh, yeah, so only about 0.5%. No, no, uh, about a couple, if I recall correctly. So that wasn't too bad. However... Now, let's address the elephant in the room. Some of these numbers are better than you might think, but there is a hidden, uh, a little hidden uh, modifier that is not very obvious here. Let's talk about what happens when you play solo queue. Now, I am a person that has played this game for many thousands of hours. I have 12,000 hours in this game. Whenever I did this experiment, in most of my games, I was trying really, really hard to win. I brought perks like Kindred to help my team. I try to have a good balance of playing the game well, but also helping my team. I try my absolute darndest, but your teammates are not going to be like that. Also, I never brought up a map offering. I never engaged with overt toxicity myself. I never did. I never disconnected myself. Uh, I never gave up except for one match. I have to admit that that was one time. Uh, so for the most part, my own non-contribution to these factors makes it better. In your own games, you will have more DC rates. In your own games, you will have more map offerings. The solo queue issues that I measured to 46%, that's only from my point of view. That's only the solo issues that I noticed. It is very possible that there were other solo issues that happened, but I didn't notice them because they didn't happen in front of me. So the 46 solo issue is actually probably much higher. It could be as high as 60 or 75%. Uh, also, let's not mention the fact that even though I noticed just a few cheaters, there is a chance that there are more cheaters out there. Also, when you play, if you play a character that people don't like, your toxicity is probably not going to be 6%. It's probably going to be higher. Not to mention if you are a minority or one of those people that often gets targeted for, for, their, for their gender or whatever, you're going to find a different rate of toxicity and your relationship to the community is going to be probably completely different. So that is the sad part. These numbers, even though they're not terrible, they are pretty much the best that they can be. When you play yourself and you don't bring all these things, your win rate is probably going to be even lower. Um, the average kill is probably going to be even higher. Uh, your teammates will DC more, more often. <laughs> Like, that's the sad part, man. That's the sad part. The sad part is that I tried my absolute best, my absolute best, uh, for the most part, to make these games the best they could, and I could barely break even. I could barely get the win rate to not even reach 50%. Compare that to playing Killer. If I play Killer with half the energy that I put into this experiment, I would win an overwhelming majority 
of my matches. If I play with my friends, even if we were not in comms, I guarantee you the solo issues would drop down to maybe 10% or 5%. These things would almost never happen. And some of these things are so easy to correct. If we just had some basic information about our teammates' perks, if we had some basic information uh, about the killer perks that are being used that someone else has seen but that we haven't been told about. Some of these things were so easy to correct, it really hurts my soul. At the end of this experiment, I noticed that the numbers are not as bad as I thought, and that is a good thing. But subjectively, the fact that some of these things could be better and they are just not, and the fact that the developers don't seem to consider these uh, information, uh, uh, the, the, this lack of information on the survivor side that plays on their own, a, a big deal, it really, really hurts me. The most depressing fact about everything that I just said is the fact that it's probably going to continue to be this way for a very long time. The developers not too long ago shared with us the data that compares solo queue survivors and team survivors. And for the average MMR, the, the, the difference is negligible. In the developer's eye, even if your experience is very different from playing in a team, your numbers are similar, so they probably do not have a priority to make solo queue any better. A shame, right? I hope that you give them some feedback to let them know that even though by numbers, the solo queue experience might be similar, in terms of fun, quality of life, and enjoyment, the solo queue experience is awful. And I hope that something is done about it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.